Hello everyone, it's Bianca Cordero, registered dietitian and sports nutritionist from Mindset First. Today I'm going to be going over just some tips for you to reduce some of the calories that we get within a day just because due to this COVID-19 pandemic, a lot of us are doing some social distancing and that means that we're expending less calories during the day. So the social distancing is great for, uh, of course, flattening the curve, which we want to do. So that's awesome if you guys are doing socially distancing and hopefully you all are. Uh, but it really does mean that we're staying at home more often and we're moving around less, meaning we're using less energy throughout the day. So the first tip I'm going to give you is to make sure that you're eating mindfully. So what I mean by that is just think about why you're eating. So there are more reasons other than just that belly hunger why people eat. So some of those are social cues. Uh, so maybe you have a significant other who is eating next to you and it makes you want to start eating or it could be even just emotional cues. So a lot of us are going through an immense amount of stress right now, which is understandable. And so that's gonna make us more likely to just eat uh, to our stress levels. And that might mean that we're eating more. And also some other cues that we might be getting might actually even be just confusion. So we might be actually in fact tired. And so that means making sure that you're getting adequate amount of sleep throughout the day, um, or at least at night. <laughs> uh, uh, meaning that you wanna make sure that you have good sleep hygiene overall. And some other things that could possibly be going on may be that you're possibly thirsty even. Uh, so sometimes we can mix up our hunger cues um, with thirst cues. The important thing is to make sure that we are drinking throughout the day. Uh, so make sure that you have some water available to you so that you can drink whenever you're thirsty um, and possibly even before you get thirsty. Uh, so some more suggestions that I would give you would be to make sure that your portion sizes are smaller. So uh, that might even be using a smaller bowl or using a smaller plate, possibly not going back for seconds or thirds or fourths. <laughs> Just making sure that you're taking a good amount at the beginning as opposed to uh, getting an, a lot of food at once. Um, so just make sure that uh, you are essentially not overeating. Another thing to ensure that you are doing is that uh, you're getting filling foods uh, that are nutritionally dense. So high fiber foods and high protein foods. Uh, so some high fiber foods that are nutri nutritionally dense would be like fruits and vegetables. Nutritionally dense high protein foods would be things like your lean meats like chicken um, or possibly turkey. And um, overall, you just wanna make sure that you are getting the same healthy diet eating less calories, making sure that you aren't grazing, making sure that you're getting enough sleep, make sure that you're drinking enough water, and of course, stay at home and stay safe.